The Thirsty Flamingo. Over the years, one of Lake James' best known hotspots for food and entertainment has been Club Paradise. Although it's been renovated many times, it's never taken on anything quite like what was proposed in the summer of 2008. Never-ending problems with the existing roof and overcrowding were common issues with the previous structure. After considering several options, it was decided that the best solution would be to enclose the existing restaurant and outdoor patio, as well as add square footage. Since the theme of the restaurant is tropical, specifically Key West, it was decided to create the new roof along with the architectural designs typically seen in Key West, Florida. In order to accomplish this, the height of the existing walls was increased, dormers installed, a galvanized roof was used, and the total exterior was modified accordingly. Owners Randy and Mitch felt it would be a good time to add 3,200 square feet of entertainment space. Following the tropical theme, the Thirsty Flamingo was born. What was originally a seasonal outdoor patio has now become a year-round island getaway. From the moment you walk through the door, you'll feel like kicking off your sandals, pulling up a chair, and forgetting about the stress of the day as you sit at the bar or maybe at one of the picnic tables and order up a drink of your choice, you're taken in by the unique combination of bright colors and decorations covering the 14-foot high walls. Immediately, your eye is drawn to the mural nestled around the stage, creating a feeling of sitting on a beach somewhere watching the sunset. The atmosphere of the Thirsty Flamingo can be enjoyed by all ages until late evening and then, after the sun goes down, the room comes alive, boasting one of the area's best audio, video, and light shows around with dancing until the early morning hours. Whether you're ordering up a drink or sitting down to eat Mahi Mahi, owners Mitch and Randy, with the help of Designing Innovations Company and various subcontractors, have created an island getaway for you right here in Northeast Indiana. Here's Roger Krukeberg of Designing Innovations Company. Hi, I'm Roger with Designing Innovations. Here we are at uh, Club Paradise, the Thirsty Flamingo Row, here located on Lake James. The original structure was had a lot of problems. It was like an old college, it had been owned by quite a few people. It really needed a facelift. Well, originally, this area was an outdoor patio. They used it mostly during the summer, and uh, they had bands up there on the stage. The problem they had was during the summer, you could only play the band so late because the neighbors would be upset with the noise and you never know it was going to rain. Imagine that, rain in Indiana. So they decided at that point in time, we need to capture that possibility. Let's, uh, let's look at enclosing this area. To tie it all together, we kind of kept the outside walls about the same height. And with that, we created some high ceilings in here. And with that, it helped with the ventilation. Uh, it doesn't get quite as smoke in here and definitely does not get as hot. The two owners love to go to Key West. They felt that the Key West theme flowed well with the lake. But one of the things that the main features in this facility is what stands behind you is the uh, paintings on, that sits behind the band. It really adds to the atmosphere and the gentleman that did this was the name, his name was King Oberman. Audio system was designed by Kip Davis. He also brought in a lot of video. TVs, got three TVs over the bar, got two big screens. Also something that's very unique is the lighting, some of the lightings that were done here. Our electrician, Keith Danford, designed some unique lighting. Some of the, uh, the lights that were hanging over the bars are actually beer buckets that have mounted lights inside them, which works well with the, again, with the atmosphere. Thank you for visiting Thirsting Flamingo. I'm Roger with Designing Innovations.